Tonight, a beloved pet brutally attacked in the Meridian Kessler neighborhood. Her owner says another dog stuck its head through a fence and bit her dog's face. News 8's Julia Dang reports the dog lost an eye and a lot of blood. So much blood. It was so bloody. Catherine Hayes says her rescue pup and loyal companion, Zelda, can now be a pirate for Halloween. The globe was taken out. Her tear ducts were taken out. Catherine, her husband, and her now one eyed mutt were playing in a neighbor's yard Monday night near Central Avenue and 47th Street. We were inside the fence, and there was an older couple maybe early 60s, walking by. According to witnesses, the couple had two dogs, both on leashes. The man had a tan or brown boxer mix. The woman had a black and white short-haired terrier mix. Catherine says the black and white dog, who appeared to weigh about 30 pounds, led the woman toward Zelda. She allowed the dog to approach the fence, and as the dog approached the fence, uh, lunged through the slats here and bit my dog right in the face and punctured her eye. I almost thought I was going to faint. It was just, I, my t shirt was covered in blood, my tennis shoes, there was so much blood. Mommy. A neighbor, Jenny Melind, says she and her daughter I saw the little piece of the eye. witnessed the immediate aftermath of the attack. We had just been petting the little dog and then we heard the commotion. She estimated it happened in under a minute. Yeah, it happened super fast. And corroborated Catherine's claim that the couple with the two dogs left the scene. I just really wish the woman would have stopped. She turned and ran with her dog. Catherine plans to file a criminal complaint, but says the only accountability she really needs is an apology. It's going to happen again. And that was Julia Dang reporting. We checked with IMPD and Animal Control, and there's no active investigation right now. But if you know anything about the attack, you can still share that information with Crime Stoppers.